I'm buzzing, let's drink up Your death look like big fun Come on, let's get it on Like that one fin gay song I'm stunning, you love it Come on, give me something I know that you want it Come on, give me something We have arrived in Dubai And look at this, it says but I'm not here alone. I'm here with Gabby. Hello. No use. So we're in. Is it the five palm? Yeah. No, you just need, a, before I even start, you just need a full room tour because I'm not over it, to be honest with you. We've had a few mishaps already, but I'll get to that because, as you know, I'm a bit of a nervous flyer, but I will tell you all the men. This lighting's washing me out very much. I've had no sleep since Friday night. It's now Sunday, so... This could be the reason. Anyway, oh, who is this? Hello. Hello. Welcome to the vlog. <laughs> <laughs> Come in, I was just in a room tour. <laughs> okay, we'll come back to the room tour. Right, let's commence with the tour that I interrupted there. Gabby's brought all her essentials. She'll be doing it, get ready with me later on. Toothbrush, very... Barbie, um, we watched that actually on the way. Um, the bathtub. I don't think we'll be getting a bath. I think we'll be getting a shower. Um, here is the shower, and then here is the loo, and a little bidet as well. And there's a mad. There's a phone in here as well, which is a bit crazy. And then to close the bathroom, how unreal is that? Can fix like alternate the light. And this is so bougie. For oh, okay. <laughs> how do I get the lights on? Oh my goodness, now. There we go. This is so bougie. I just love everything. Every interior aspect. And they've also got those ritual stuff as well. Unreal. And then when you come out, these are our wardrobes. How do you open them, Gab? Is it like a little... Are they wardrobe? Yeah. Oh, there we go. Oh, is that pulled down red? Oh, no. Oh, that's gorge. I think they're wardrobes, though, yeah. aren't they? Where's the girls? Is that it? Oh. Oh, oh, we've got robes. <laughs> oh, I might put oh, that on after my shower, actually, before we get ready for tonight. Oh, snaz. And then we're just unpacking. Gabby started. There's my, honestly, I don't know how that case did not explode. Then I had that, and then here, this room is absolutely gorgeous. So we've got two double beds. We were saying we didn't know whether to get, like, one all together, but getting ready and stuff, it'll just be easier. Lovely oval mirror for the nice pics. This is stunning. It just adds so much depth to the room. Love the chandelier as well. Marble side cabinets. Just the bed and feels very luxe as well. And then here we've got a little bar, which is absolutely stunning. Sorry, literally there's only two of us. Um, you obviously have to pay for these sort of bits, but just got your teas, your coffees, your crisp. Hmm interesting one and you drink and then this is the view which i think is gorgeous so we're on so what's the view what is that view of gab is that like the palm is that what they call it the palm jumeir so, yeah. yeah so we're on like the palm jumeir right so i mean i know it's a little bit far away but in person it feels closer do you know what i mean um and then look oh, this isn't that lovely so the girls actually literally just two floors above us we couldn't get in on the same floor which was a bit annoying um but it is what it is we'll we're only sleeping here, do you know what I mean? Um, so, how does it get on with flying? I know you are all worried about me because I'm, I'm a nervous flyer. How was I, Gab? Oh, you were absolutely fine. I was shocked. <laughs> <laughs> I you feel like, no, I was shocked. But everyone was saying, like, a big plane, you can't feel it, like, take off. Because I've only been on, like, I mean, I went on a long haul flight to New York when I was 18. Like, that was literally, like, eight years ago. But I feel like a long haul flight like that, I've never done. And... Honestly, it was really good. It was Emirates were amazing. The only thing I'm, I'm with you about Emirates was they didn't have like milk alternatives. I know they only had normal milk, so she was like, "Do you want that or not?" And I was like, <laughs> "Not on that." So I literally had like a black tea on the plane. I was like, "This is not ideal." And um, but apart from that, it was amazing, and it was literally the most luxurious experience. Like we were just in economy, and it was like so luxurious. It was lovely. Um, and as I say, I've never flew Emirates before, but I love the experience. So I feel less because, like, the build-up to it was so anxious. Like, you just look at my lips, the cold sores from anxiety. Do I want them in my Insta pics? No, I do not. Um, but, yeah, like, I was so worked up. But I've always 
experience like short haul not long haul so i think that's why i was so anxious so i feel a bit less anxious going home if that makes sense but i still didn't enjoy the experience at the same time i know it won't make sense to people who enjoy flying it will to people who don't but yeah um if you are scared of flying defo would recommend so we've got here and as you can see from outside the weather's not it apparently it rains 11 days in the whole year and we're here for two of those 11 days when it's raining so we literally got here and i had no sleep and um, got here at seven o'clock this morning flew out last night we flew out at birmingham we usually go to manny but it was like a lot cheaper to fly so you should always check and um, so we went to birmingham airport grim airport by the way sorry to offend anyone but not the best getting worked on um went there and then got here at seven o'clock in the morning by the time we'd sorted ourselves out and that we didn't leave the airport till nine and then we got to the hotel and they were just went down so very quickly we were like and we'd got like a five it's called five in here in this hotel like an event and um, but got cancelled because it was the weather honestly it was like the world had literally ended which i can understand because they never get rain which by the way is fake rain sorry to be mumbling on about rain but anyway i feel like i'm mumbling we're gonna now have a little bit of a nap because it's like three o'clock and then we're getting ready because we're going to surf which is a beach club um but again that could be cancelled because the weather which is just like so annoying because we've literally like planned this trip hoping we get winter sun and we haven't so we're gonna get ready and then i'll get back to you when we've had a sleep and we're ready to go god you just look at that view in the back we're just on our way to surf say hello hey i met molly gabby <laughs> So they said our event was cancelled, but it actually wasn't. So we're technically still going to surf. Um, so yeah, looking forward to um, we just being cackled. <laughs> we just being cackled. <laughs> um, yeah, we're just going to surf. Apparently, it's meant to be lovely. So we shall see. And um, let's drink up. You does look like big fun. Come on, let's get it on like that one fin gay song. I'm stunning, you love it. Come on, give me something. I know that you want it. Come on, give me something. The night is young and so are we. So maybe you should leave with me. I'm just actually not even over this view, to be honest. Can you see a mint now? It's absolutely unreal. Wow, I'm just not over this shoes, like, and then they have music playing from the palms, this real life. The night is young and so are we, baby, the night is young, so let's have some fun. If you love me right, yeah, this could be the summer of our lives now, honey. Give it to me like you know you should now, baby, this could be the summer of <laughs> I thought you could see it. Folks, what you got on? Talk squatch. Uh, a pair of white pants on with the matching shirt and a little bikini on. Oh, Gav, you look gorgeous. <laughs> and I've got a boohoo cover up and black bikini. So, we just been for breakfast, as you've seen. No, look at the sun news. How gorgeous. So, we're going to go to Five Beach Club. Like, literally, none of us have got makeup on. I look so fresh faced. Actually, feel a bit ashamed. Just packing this little Zara bag. Um, so, this was like going to be our quiet day because we thought it was going to be like thunderstorming. Now, last night, apparently, an alarm went off. Me and Gabby were out for the count. Did we sleep for like 10 hours? Yeah. We slept for like 10 hours because we had the worst like jet lag. And then, um, apparently, like, you know, that phone alarm that everyone's got? Ours didn't go off. Did ours go off or we just didn't hear it? 
Mine never went. I never went off either. Um, but apparently, like, that Dr. Alex, who was on the islands in our hotel, and he put a post on and was like, I literally got woken up by this alarm, and me and Gabby didn't know what was going on. Apparently, the hotel could have been evacuated, and we were just, like, snoring. But anyway... Why did you watch your vlog? I know. Hi! We're in your hotel. <laughs> um, we're going to go to Five. Is it Five Beach? Sounds fancy, anyway. See you there.
get it on like that on fin gay song i'm stunning you love it come on give good morning from our messy room in dubai the sun is out today no use we had the most gorgeous night last night sorry i've literally just washed my hair like am i okay no let's let's so last night was hilarious if you do anything in dubai please do opa because oh my god entertained for the foreseeable future like i mean we were the entertainment as well like if you follow me on instagram just, oh, just hysterical honestly and then after it we went to some club i think it was called blue or something like an r&b club on a monday night rocked in early hours this morning i've had four hours sleep sorry i'm 26 i can't handle this like i am fully retired i've woke up late me and gabby i've woke up late i would just said to the girls if you want to go to the beach club today earlier than us please do because like my hair was a show it needed washing do you know what i mean so we're gonna get ourselves ready i feel like i've not shown you any of my outfits so the outfit that i had on last night i'll insert here it was from zara literally like three or four years ago i got it when i think we were even meant to be going on holiday in lockdown and i just never wore it so it had its work last night love it um it was given grecian grecian sorry grecian um i've just topped my tan up as well it's looking a bit patchy so excuse whilst it's evolving um yeah to think i'm having to put tan on in a sunny country because that's how bad the weather's been like I catch the sun. I haven't been on holiday in three years, and this, this, this one. Look, I look whiter than I did in the UK. Anyway, um, what was I saying then? Oh my God, it's the housekeeping. One sec. Now we've got our two not to step sign on. Surely not. Um, anyway, yeah, I'm going to start getting ready today. I'll show you what I'm wearing. That quick, whilst my hair is just. Yeah, everyone else basically is ready. I slept in. Use. I can't just have four hours sleep. You know, if you've been following me for a long time, I just need my sleep. I need it. This like gorgeous, you can't really see it. It'll look better on. Um, it's like crinkled fabric Primark bikini, a tenner. The only reason I got this was because I couldn't find a brown nice bikini anywhere because I got this gorgeous set from Zara. Um, let me just pop you. I'll pop you here. Can I pop you there? Yeah. I got this gorgeous little set from Zara. So this is like a little shawl, gorge. Even though I do say so myself, by the way. And then these little pants with like this like little thing on the bottom like crinkled end gorgeous um but yeah i'll film so because we haven't been able to go to like proper beach clubs i haven't really been able to get like good daytime vlogging content as of yet today that's gonna change um so yeah i'll film the girls and all that um but yeah i need to go and get ready because these are gonna kill me at any minute but i needed to wash my hair it was a shit what a gorgeous day <laughs> isn't it <laughs> Wow, can we just say how gorgeous Unreal. the girl is? Look! <laughs> Unreal. And then the view, just to compliment the vibes. So, we're just on our way to Sand Beach. We're just hoping there's a buggy, because like, there's a buggy that comes down in Jumeirai Beach. We're hoping that we can hop on. Not too sure whether we can. So, we've got to wash my hair, but Dubai water is not the one, you guys. But everyone's out. Look! The gardeners are out. Man's happy on the bench. The bin men are out. <laughs> Everyone's out. The walkers. The whole gang is here. Come on, give me something. The night is young, and so are we. So maybe you should leave with me. The night is young, and so are we.
gonna lie you the filming today has not been the best we've just got back it's like three o'clock in the morning but our room was really messy it was really bad i'll catch up with everything look at the guys so no, look at the organization we're nearly in tears like how cute is that so this outfit looked better when i actually when I actually went out before, but you know, dragged her head back because of the situation. But it's still okay. It looked better before. It's literally just started to cave in. I do like it, but I would say, girls, it's not. It's not great. It just basically this just partitions away. So beware. Um, I've also caught the sun. Don't know how. I fell asleep for about an hour or two. Um, but yeah, we went to STK. Dubai, which was okay. I do prefer the London one. Um, but we had an absolute scream, and then. We came, we went to this club called Blah Blah, that was a bit crazy. Um, and then we just got a taxi home, which I'll have inserted clips. Hilarious. You let me put Shakira on, but I make mates with them, so I think that's why they let me put music on. But yeah, we're getting ready to go to bed because we need to be up early for Cove Beach, which I'm really excited for. It's like one of the best days, and then it's our like full last day. Do you want to say them words because I'm having the best time? Um, but yeah, oh, and also, actually, I haven't even caught you up with what's happened today. When to snow, <laughs> went to San Beach Club, gorgeous. I think I've been to clips, got told off for filming. No, I know, furious, and then came home and <laughs> fell right there in front of Gabby. I literally had dressing gown on. Everything, like, I've got the biggest bruise. Can you see me bruise? I mean, look here. Look at that. The wound. We were laughing. Um. And I said it had been me. I said it had been, like, three things have happened. What was it? Um. I can't remember now. I feel like we've done a f few funny things. Yeah, basically, I'm just the clown on this ship, to be honest with you. Um, but yeah, anyway, I think that's all the updates. I'm not too sure. But I feel like I've done no, like, what I'm wearing videos. So I'm going to pop you in the... No, that's terrible lighting, isn't it? So I'll just do it like this. This is why I don't do stuff like this. This is not my thing. I'll pop you there. So, <laughs> no, I won't. Pop you there. Okay, right. So, today, I don't like that. Where can I put you? Ah, uh, that's better. So, I've got on a bikini from Opoly, skirt from PLT, shoes from Ego, and I've got this little choker on from Primark. And we are going, where are we going, Gab? Cove Beach. We're going to Cove Beach. Um, we feel tired today. <laughs> I do anyway. And that aircon has dried my throat up. Literally so, so much. I also need to spray perfume in my hair ASAP because everyone smoking in the club last night has got my hair stinking. Um, but yeah, we're going to Cove Beach for... Is it Ladies Day brunch or just brunch? It's Ladies Day, yeah. It's Ladies Day. Every day is Ladies Day, though. I'm buzzing, let's drink up. You deaf look like big fun. Come on, let's get it on. Like that on Finn Gayson. I'm stunning, you love it. Come on, give me something. I know that you want it. Come on, give me something. The night is young and so are we. Oh my God, Jews, it's Valentine's Day. And look what the mates do. I cannot cope. They are the cutest. I've never felt so loved on a Valentine's Day. Like, that is so cute. Happy Valentine's, girlies. Happy Valentine's. I'm Beth. Happy Valentine's. Actually, go 
corner shop. This is what I'm looking at. I'm literally coming home. So, obviously, I'm a nervous flyer. And I am really nervous to go home, but I'm actually a bit more reassured because of how amazing Emirates was. I think I'm actually going to do a separate video. I think I'm going to do a TikTok on, like, like people being scared of flying because I didn't realise, like, how popular it was. Popular, I wouldn't say it like that. But how common it is. Um, I also feel like I've been a bit of a rubbish vlogger. Only because I've really wanted to, like, enjoy my holiday. I haven't been on holiday in three years. and I've never said that a million times, honestly. But I just feel like I really deserve this holiday. I've worked so hard for a while. And I just wanted to shut off. And I know I feel like sometimes obliged that I have to do content for YouTube, TikTok, and, you know, Instagram. It is my job. But at the same time, it's hard to find that balance. And I think because doing this job, I haven't been on holiday yet. I haven't... I don't know that yet, so I'm sort of learning the ropes and things like that. It's just been so fun. We've laughed every minute of the day. We've honestly had the best time. I couldn't have thought of better people to come away with. I've honestly, we've cried laughing. That's probably why I haven't picked up the camera. Like the moments that you want to capture, you don't, don't you? Like when you're on holiday. Um, but it's been absolutely phenomenal. So yeah, we're literally just heading the airport now. I've just had night nightmare as you've seen, shut on that case. I actually want to come away every Valentine's. Like, I actually love this time of year to come away. And also didn't realise, I went to New York, New York eight years ago, this same time with school on a long call. So it must be when the vibes are good for me to fly. So yeah, um, I'm wearing these for the airport. By the way, these are so good. They're like a Hermes Jeep from Ego. Um, but yeah, anyway, Gabby has just gone to get up from the girls' room and then we're literally just checking out. This has been such a gorgeous hotel as well. We've been staying in a fire farm and it's been unreal. I think there's someone next door. Um, yeah, we've been staying in the fire farm and that's been the view. The room's been gorgeous. I had a Valentine set up yesterday. Honestly, you can't even see me, but everything has just been spectacular from start to finish. I just feel like I'm becoming here more often. I mean, I am manifesting to move here. It has made me want to move here even more. So we'll see what the future holds. So you could be watching this video and I could be here living in Dubai. Summer.